What's up, everybody? Welcome to a new English Beat. I'm thrilled to beat to announce that today we've got a very special video. Thrilled to beat means very pleased and excited. Firstly, it's English Beat number 100. Secondly, today the channel is turning two years old. And on top of that, it's my birthday. So let's blow out the candle and make a wish. That's why in today's English bit, we're going to learn five informal expressions with the verb to blow. Are you ready? So let's kick off. Before we start, let's look at some most common meanings of the verb to blow. It's irregular and it's to blow, blue, long u and blown. The first meaning is to send out air from your mouth. En castellano sería soplar. For example, I've never blown into a breathalyzer. We also use the verb to blow with the wind. For example, the wind is blowing hard today. The second meaning of the verb to blow is to waste an opportunity. For example, I blew a chance to make a good impression by getting late to the job interview. The second example, you had your chance and blew it. Another meaning is to waste your money on unnecessary things. For example, I blew all the money left on a pair of slouchy jeans. And another example, he finds it hard to make ends meet as he tends to blow his money. And now let's start with our five informal expressions. The first one is to blow your mind. If something blows your mind, it means that you find it extremely exciting and impressive. And now let's look at some examples. The first one, scuba diving in Gilimeno really blew my mind. And the second example, I'm sure Edinburgh will blow your mind. Now let's move on to our second expression, which is to blow your own trumpet or your own horn. Trumpet is British and horn American. It means to tell everybody proudly about your achievements. It's like the verbs to show off, brag or boast. And now let's look at some examples. The first one, she can't help blowing her own trumpet. And the second example, I can't stand people who blow their own horn. And now let's learn our expression number three, which is to blow a fuse. It means to become very angry. And now let's look at two examples. The first one, she blew a fuse for no reason. And the second example, he blew a fuse when he found out that his car had been towed. And now let's look at our expression number four, which is to blow somebody or something out of the water. It means to destroy or defeat something or somebody completely, or to do something much better than others. And now let's look at some examples. The first one, the job interview was a success. She blew other job candidates out of the water. And the second example, Usain Bolt blew the competition out of the water. And last but not least, the expression to blow up in your face. It means that a plan or a situation goes wrong. And now let's look at some examples. The first example, it will blow up in your face if you keep being so careless. And the second example, his decision to quit his job blew up in his face as he's been out of work for a year now. So thanks a lot for joining this special English bit. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a like and to subscribe to the channel. With that being said, thanks for watching and see you next week. Ciao for now!